One of our goals has been to enable each person to carry with them in a smart card or a USB drive, some small form factor, their entire genome so that they can go to a healthcare provider in the future and say, this is me. And this follows from some work that I pioneered and others pioneered 10 years ago or more. There's a couple of techniques. One is called chunking. And the way you do that is you break things up into pieces. You do it deterministically and you store it. Then you get another piece and you say, well, have I stored this before? And if you already have it, then you don't have to store it again. The other is a technique called delta compression, which I've been working on and off with colleagues at IBM and elsewhere. And what you try to do is you try to encode one thing using the minimum number of changes to represent some other thing. So what we've done in terms of genomics is we take the reference genome and then we take your genome and we only record the differences. What's really enabled the work for me here in terms of genomic data has been the presence of the bioinformatics group and David Hausler's research and David himself. At the end of the day, I need real data in order to validate these algorithms because it's not about the optimal performance of this algorithm in the best case. It's about the performance of this algorithm on millions or billions of genomes and has to work well all the time.